Well, speaking of seeing how it goes, you got the le- rest of the crew available? Uh, oh, yeah. We do have a segment I... to do. We have a show to put on. I already, oh, had, yeah. one, I already had a major blunder tonight. Yeah, stupidity. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, dude, we got so much stupid to get to get through. Yeah, let's go ahead and get. It can't let's be go ahead. And... It, it can't be more stupid than what I just did because I swear I can't believe I turned that fucking goddamn freaking button. I with that button. I fucked up all my audio. By the way, what 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 uh what are you using for your uh for your for your mixer? Are you uh, are you using like? Are you using like a physical mixing board or a, a, or is a full, software? A, a full mixing board, uh, alias an alias mixing board, full USB oh, compatible. Oh, Problem oh was, they're good. I never set up. I never Hello. hit that little button to let you get to let the Skype call in. Hey, oh, Nicola. okay. Hey, Kitty. Hello. Oh, we got a way pussy. Yes, room. Kitty. And, and Nicholas here yeah. too. Kitty suddenly decided to attack. Uh. Shoot. Well, it's always uh, good. When, okay. it's, it's always good when we see an abidal pussy, and your cat. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, let's see. I need to bring in Susie too. Let's also, Tony, what happened to the floppy hair? I like the floppy hair. Floppy hair go bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> Tony got Tony got Tony got sick of floppy hair, so Tony so Tony take electric razor, and Tony shave floppy hair. <laughs> I was wondering <laughs> when I was going to be brought in. <laughs> yeah, well. Hello, every- Hello everyone. Hey. hey. We have an Aussie in the room. We have a Scott. We have an Irish. We have an Aussie. <laughs> we have a pub joke. But, <laughs> yes, uh, this uh, is a pub joke ready to happen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody say bye to Kelly. <laughs> but before oh, everybody say oh. bye to Mantis. I was about to talk about, you know, playing Arkham City and saying that Mantis was a better... Harley Quinn than Harley Quinn the game was. Well, we already, everybody already knows that. So. Now all I need is a cat. Now all I need is a cat woman, and my uh, my perfect night will be by night will be perfect. Hmm. Like, Who we could play like, cat I, woman? I, I, okay, I would. Ask, I would. Like, Tony, I would say I would ask. Have cat there. Tony, hey, I would say uh, I would ask her to join us for this uh, segment, but I don't have her on Skype, so. I I do. Uh, yeah, Kelly? she. she Kelly, she removed if, me from Skites. She removed me from uh, Skites. All well. right, all right, all right. The shit happens. I'm sure it was. I know. I know what happened. Uh, Kelly, if you want to join us on Skype for this segment, you're more than welcome to. Oh, did I confuse Mantis? Would you leave, leave her time? alone? <laughs> okay, great. Okay, great. Kelly uh, is going to be joining us. Woo-hoo! Leave Mantis alone. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, these are yeah, but 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 yeah, these are these these are things we know. Uh, it's cold. It's cold. It's cold as fuck outside. And and yes, uh, Brent, Kelly what's and, that? and Kelly and and Kelly is the ultimate um, Harley Quinn. These are things we know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah, we're getting hit yeah. by. She doesn't storms even know who I am anymore. Off. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, but I, Susie, we, I feel so we, sorry for you. It's damn. fucking freezing here, and it must be worse in Scotland. <laughs> hey, it's, it's fucking that. cold. It's fucking cold here too. So it's, we're getting it's just, storms off the yeah. yeah, but we we and, get to um, we get to look at Susie's amazing new hairdo. Yes, and uh, Tony, you're that. not Tony. The the bald hey. hair is. Hey, Tony, the bald head isn't really doing it for me. It's more. It's less Austin and more Will Sasso. Oh, hold on. Sorry. Wait. Let me turn this off. Okay. I don't know if I, I, I got be... it. Uh, hey, Kelly. Hi. How are Hi. you? Hi. I'm hey, fine. Kelly. Sorry about Hey, Kelly. About that. It's good. It's okay. Good to talk to you again. Good to have you on it's the show. Uh, thank you. Why, yeah, for having me. Who can... is who is yelling at me? Uh, no, I'm like... not yelling at you. No one's yelling at you. Uh, I'll say hello. Well, who's the? Awesome accent. Who? Uh... <laughs> that is Nick. That could be one of three of oh, us. Oh, in, in Nick. Will... Yeah, just call me yeah. Nick. Yeah, just call me Nick. I was okay. mentioning how I was playing Arkham City and how you're a better Harley Quinn. <laughs> Thank you. Better Harley. Mm-hmm. Than her, but you mean you're... now? All I need is a cat woman, and I'll be perfect. <laughs> hey, she, yeah. hey, she she can do that too. Play play mm. yeah, play, play both roles. Random <laughs> insanity. Random insanity okay. here on Center Radio. 
I love my girlfriend. Please don't hurt me, Christine. <laughs> she just got a new, she just got a new tattoo. Well, I love, I love my tattoo. Fia- well, I love my fiance, so please don't make do anything that it makes it hurt me. So I'm single. Love- you guys can say whatever the fuck you want. I don't give a shit. I love, well, I, I love my I love my fiance and she's fucking awesome. So I had nothing to worry about. <laughs> well, t- Tony, Tony, we had a reason for this call. We had a agenda here tonight. So what, oh what's going on? What's on your plate of all of this? Okay, okay. I when I said that this is going to be probably my favorite one, probably probably for the rest of the year. I'm calling it right now. Um, yeah, this is it. Oh, Jesus, oh sorry. <laughs> That's my phone. It's very appropriate oh. for what he just said. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I thought that I thought I thought I thought that was LC for a minute. <laughs> I, I, I wish I had that technology. I wish I could add those little audio tracks. But okay, first off, let me okay, let me let me ask everybody um in the sky in the Skype chat. We'll go we'll go down by the way they are in my window. Okay. Cartoon crushes growing up. Okay, LC, growing up, who, what animated character did you have a crush on? What animated character did I have a crush on? Yes. I, okay, 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 okay. I'll tell you what. I will start it off. Mine, bear, bear in mind, I was 10, Rainbow Bright. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> All right, what what was her name from he- from Heathcliff? That little uh, white cat. Oh, uh, um, that was Chloe. Chloe. Yeah. Oh God, damn Chloe. She. Oh, <laughs> I'm telling All you, right. her, her her and a fucking bottle of fucking goddamn fucking hair gel. Oh my God, that made my night back in the day. Anyway, I am okay. so surprised, honey. I thought you'd say Chitara. <laughs> well, Chitara All right. Yes. You right. okay. Chitara, yes. Okay, now, okay, now, Nick, who is your animated uh, crush? Mm. Don't worry, we won't judge you much. <laughs> I think my first real one had to have been Misty from Pokemon. Nice, nice one. And May, and May the brown, the brunette from Pokemon. Mmm, she wasn't half bad too. Okay. You want to see that? Did anyone see that recent Pokemon girl with the with the skirt that was just basically underwear? I have no with idea. The short, I, shorts that were like. I stopped watching Pokemon after Generation One. So. Uh, well, as a gamer, I see all the uh, the uh, the uh, trainers, and like one of them had like shorts that were the that were like this. That was her. Thick. Yeah. That, that that was her. I mean, good yeah. God. Any any shorter, and, and if she sneezed, there'd be an automatic G string. But yeah, Misty was. <laughs> okay. She was something. Okay, and uh, okay, Kelly, who was your a- animated a- animated crush? Shredder from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Nice. <laughs> That's terrible. No, it's bad. Well, hey, I mean, it ta- you know, it takes all kind. Hey. Mine, if, mine... It, if it was reality, if it was reality, you'd be getting nailed by Kevin Nash. <laughs> yeah, I, I, you know what? I, I like, the, I always like the evil ones the best, and it still <laughs> goes to the stay. So yeah, oh, Shredder, yeah, Shredder pushed me into the realm of. Why am I attracted to this? This is strange. I'm like, I'm like <laughs> is, five. Is anyone, just uh, to, is anyone else having a problem with Tony's webcam? Because it's just not. My webcam. Yeah, that, it happens every week. My it happens every week. Minimized. I I'm, getting hypnoti- I'm getting hypnotized by the rotating circle. And, uh, My webcam is I, shit. Don't worry about it. I will do your bidding, Skype circle. <laughs> but, I will, but, uh, I will ma- destroy, I will destroy t- Mumbler. <laughs> My Mumbler. Skill, again. Okay, now, uh, Ni- Nicola, animated, animated crush, go. To be truly honest, I never really had one. Well, I was a very strange person who didn't really discover sexuality until my late teens. <laughs> okay, now, okay, another question then. What was the very first anime character you looked up with the number rule 34? <laughs> yeah. Still hasn't happened. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, so, okay, so Nicola is the exception to the rule. Like oh. all, like always. Uh, <laughs> See, I hit eighteen. 
And then I started meeting some friends, and then I learned about anime. And then I met Aaron, and then I was just corrupted entirely. <laughs> and oh, okay. Well, that well that works. All right. Furries All right. and porn everywhere. <laughs> All right, Susie, animated <laughs> a- animated crush, go. I don't wanna. <laughs> Oh, it's My clearly mu- OC because oh. he's clearly an animated character. He has well, the mind really of an animated really character. See, go ahead. Oh, well, weird. We already think you're weird. It's, go not, it's not weird. Well, well oh, Su- sweetie, Susie, my buddy, Susie, my buddy's on Snark. Ew. Sweetie, go, Ew. Sweetie, go, go, sweetie, go, go ahead. You're, nobody's going to judge you. Is it one of the Disney princes? It's a oh, Disney character. <laughs> Okay. Is Gaston? it the Beast? No. Gaston? <laughs> it's Woody from Toy Story. Really? Oh, oh yeah. that's not that's not that bad. Don't be embarrassed wait, about wait, wait. that. It's Woody from Toy Story. That's cute. Wouldn't that technically make him a sex toy? No. <laughs> Okay. Wait, 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 so oh god, I remember the parody <laughs> sex toy story. I have a yes. thing for cowboys and his voice. I, I love voices. I'm attracted to voices, and god damn it, I love that oh, voice. Hi. Yeah, I'm. Uh-huh, uh-huh, I'm a, give me that. I'm attracted to voices too, and let me tell you from personal experience, don't don't follow it. It's bad. Just just don't. Why am I feeling this? Like, <laughs> Are you oh. kidding me, Kelly? That's how I got all my relationships. <laughs> well, congratulations, fucking right? Oh my god. Okay, so the moral well, the girls well, like gotta... the accent. Ah! Okay, so... yeah. Well, okay, well, so well guys, well guys, well guys, I gotta say, I gotta say this, Susie. Is that why you asked me to wear the cowboy boots and the cowboy hat that night? Maybe. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> Tony, oh, we're yes. right. here still again. What, what do you have on your plate right. uh, tonight? All right. So oh, the reason I bring this up is that, okay, it's perfectly normal, Susie, to develop <laughs> crushes on animated characters and the like. Phew. But Jessica Rabbit, anyone? Oh, my hell dad. Yeah. Oh, hell, hell yeah. Hell my dad. Yeah. Okay, okay, but... How, okay, hey, 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 no, 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 okay. Holly, how many... Hollywood. Hollywood from Mad World was so much greater than just grab it. Okay. Oh, my God. How many, how many women, how many teen girls did Jessica Rabbit turn by Curious? Almost as many as uh, Angelina honestly, Jolie and Lara Croft. <laughs> I honestly don't want to think about that right now. I'd argue. I'd argue. <laughs> <laughs> uh... But anyway, like I was saying, um, <laughs> like, okay, adoration toward a character is all well and good. You know, it's natural. It's normal. You, you, you know, all that good crap. But it can go too far. And I have several examples today. Uh-oh. Okay, if this is about this guy who sent no, 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 you, 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 you shush, you shush, you shush. Oh, oh dear. You shush. <laughs> oh, shit, we just heard something we shouldn't. You shush. Oh, yeah. Okay. It's okay, it's okay. I had to explain why I squeaked out earlier on in the living room while me and a bunch of friends were sitting watching Helsing Ultimate. Oh, I went, sad. oh, my dear God, out loud, and they made me read this out. <laughs> bitches, love, bitches love cannons. Anyway, uh, <laughs> well, now hold on. So, I blame you for that weird, awkward scenario. But go on. <laughs> okay. That's good. Okay. Um, I could explain said uh, letter, but instead I will read the letter in its entirety. And you wait a minute. Where did where did this come from? I'm sorry. This okay. I believe this is from somebody on DeviantArt. So this oh, is no. and, uh, this, oh god. Oh, cool. I, just, I, okay. Wait, okay. wait, wait, wait. Is this is this is random or? Uh, I found it at random. Yes. You found it at random, so it wasn't sent to you. Okay. No. Okay. No. No. Okay. So let's hear this. And what is it called? Okay, this is called Regarding Twilight Spri- uh, Sparkle. I'm saying sprinkle. Okay, so it's you here. <laughs> regarding, regarding Twilight Sparkle. We're in a world of her Kev- here. Dear, mm-hmm. dear Kevin, dear Kevin so- Sona, apparently Kevin Sona is the artist title. 
this may be the strangest message you will ever receive, but I, I... Tony. Yes. I'm sorry. I don't, and everyone, I don't mean to interrupt. Twilight <laughs> Sparkle, which one is that? Is that the purple? It's the purple one. Is purple it the Tara one. Strong one? Yep, that's the one. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. I don't right. have a Twilight Sparkle right. toy, which makes me I'm, sad. I'm sorry. Oh, I, it's okay. <laughs> No, yeah, this thing was going to make me feel very is, awkward because I have a whole bunch of these guys sitting looking at me. Not, that is not Harley Quinn. <laughs> but continue. Uh, that is uh, a nerd rage, and we will not get into it. Yes. Tony, continue. Yes. Thank you. It's the purple one with the horn. Okay. Yes. Thank. Okay. Yeah. This. Okay, but I I do hope you'll take the time to read this and c- and consider what what I have to say. And we are. To put it sim- to put it simply, I would really appreciate if the next time your, your birthday comes around, you would re- you you would request that your that your club artist friends who would like to give you se- sexually oriented pony art as gifts, draw some draw some pony other than Twilight Sparkle for um, you. What's a club artist? Um, Don't ask. Someone who does no, erotic really, I... fiction of ponies. Oh, okay, so it's like a furry... It's one person. section of the fandom I really don't like. <laughs> Same here. Okay. It's the, it's, so it's a section mm. of the fandom that gives the entire fandom a bad name, is what yeah. I mean. Yeah. It, it, it's, like if, it's like if somebody wanted to, to draw you as a pony, you would go to a clop artist. Okay, gotcha. Okay. I, I'm sorry, I don't mean That's to... That's okay, but, don't worry about it. But I have no I, I have no clue. Like, I, me and the ponies, we don't know each other, so... I don't yeah. either, but this is... okay. I shouldn't really say anything against that, because Phil Bunny drew a pony for my birthday a couple of years oh, ago. I, I like Phil Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> drawing ponies is fine. I have no issues with drawing ponies. Uh, drawing them in sexual it, context is just it, wrong. It's, it's fine to draw a pony. It's not fine to draw a pony in a pornographic state. Well, all I know yeah. is that I have seen, like, things on the internet of, uh, I guess, I, I'm, I don't want to say it, but I guess they are bronies. I mean, I don't like that term. It's, I think it's stupid. But um, bronies, I guess, and it was a selling of a pony, and it was a straight up sex. You guys about yeah. yeah my stream just froze i missed all that well uh they're, they're selling po- there's selling ponies with a hole in the in the rear it's all oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. So oh no that's oh, that's it's, always that, it's always that blue one that blue one with the rainbow hair rainbow what's, dash what's, yeah that one the one with the wings oh, oh it's lira the lira yeah. a, fan, a, a background character Okay. They make one of derpy. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, all right. So the consensus yep. that that we've got so, so far is that is that that this guy yes. is is asking this this person to not to not get se- sexually explicit clop, clop art of Twilight Sparkle. Now, the reason I ask this is that Twilight is my fiance. <laughs> and we're and we're planning on getting married next June or July, should everything go as planned, financially speaking. And yes, I have actually found a wedding chapel that will let me marry some someone that most people would consider a fictional character. Wait, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Stop it! Guys. Yeah, how to marry Woody? No. <laughs> No, 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 no. What? Yeah, that's very. What do you? Can you please explain, like, to friends, like, because we're friends, and I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, and. He's marrying an animated character. Tony, can I hear that one more time, please? Just for first. No, he's not. He's. What? Tony. Tony. Yeah, Tony. Tony. Tony, please, can you repeat that statement? Because I want to make sure before I do what I'm going to do here. Okay. The reason I ask this is that Twilight is my fiance, and we are planning on getting married next June or July, should everything go as planned, financially speaking. And yes, okay. I have actually okay. found a... Tony, I did hear what I had to hear, and uh, I don't want to do this, but I think it's appropriate. Okay. 
Am I in the fucking Twilight Zone? What the <laughs> fuck just happened? I, I thought you were engaged. What am I? Well, are you in the Twilight Zone? Yeah. Are you trolling me? I swear to God. Are you? Oh, are this you? Is an, Kelly, sweetheart, this is an actual Kelly. letter sent to a deviant art artist. <laughs> read the rest. Oh. Read the rest. No, no. Ke- wait, Kelly. Did, did, did you think that this was me? Sorry. Yes, I did. Oh my god! <laughs> all, right. all right, guys. Tell it, tell it, I don't even tell do your turn. You everyone. take Twilight Sparkle to be your lovely wedding. Okay, Kelly. So everyone <laughs> is clear on what's Should going on here. Even? Everyone. So everyone. So everyone is clear on what's going on here. Basically, Tony is reading a fan letter written to a fan a fan letter. Fan, I ain't fan fucking art. no pony, okay? <laughs> <laughs> well, I knew that, but I was like, okay, I knew and I was again. like two it, weeks, but what the fuck did I miss right now? I didn't know. No, <laughs> and, no. and yet again, if, you, if you're if you that oh, obsessed God. with a fucking pony, this ain't a drink no. for happiness. This is a drink of depression. Let me be clear. I am get a fucking life! life. Let me let me make this perfectly clear. Yeah, I am happily engaged to a woman. That's why I, <laughs> I knew you were, and I was like, wait. No, no, okay, Ken uh, Kelly, what I'm reading is a letter that somebody sent to a deviant art artist. Okay. Okay. All right. Now I have a lot to that go through. Everything. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hey, let, let Tony finish the letter, please. Uh, yeah, cause, cause, yeah, cause I got a shit ton to go through here. Now, go now, but. Now, now, before you go thinking, this guy is either completely crazy or just screwing with me, please hear me out on, on this, <clears throat> okay? You see, I am totally head over heels in love with Twilight Sparkle. I have been for about 11 months now, and at this point, I am in a committed relationship with my Twily. <laughs> By that, I mean I don't date anyone else. I don't sleep with anyone else. <laughs> And I have zero interest in having what? any other kind of relationship with any other than the than the, than the mayor I than the mayor I adore. That's a that's a medical issue. Something's like, like love, something's very wrong. I love her with all my heart, and I am one hundred percent committed to that love. Have you heard of my oh my <laughs> Express my, to express my love in a in a real tangible way, I have a beautiful handmade custom oh. Twilight Sparkle plushie that I can that I can that I can hug, kiss, cuddle up with <laughs> to go to to go to sleep with at night, I mean, and, to, and to take out on the town to do all the fun things together that for most couples do. I take her out to eat at night, vegetarian <laughs> restaurants. I'm breaking myself. <laughs> we go shopping together. I take her out for coffee. We do social activities like hanging out with friends, seeing movies, etc. And I. Why has this guy not been committed do, by his do, re- do you realize also that this is like high? High, very extreme psychosis. If this oh, yeah. is real, oh yeah, gets, this is like, complete schizophrenia. It gets, this it gets, this is yeah. like Tony. Tony, honestly, this is a this is a fucking this, just a, 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 a random fan art. This yeah. is pure schizophrenia. Yeah, it gets better. Oh, oh god. And I talk about her as if she is Twilight because to me she very much is. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> when I when I look at her, I see Twilight Sparkle. When I talk with her, I'm talking to Twilight. When I hold her in my arms and kiss her, there's no doubt in my mind. It's more than I love whose lips are pressed against mine. And every morning I open my eyes and see her head on the pillow next to mine with her gorgeous violet eyes staring back at me. I can't help but... I can't help Yeah, but this wonder, might be one of the worst things I've ever heard. I can't help but wonder <sighs> how I got so lucky to have, to have a partner as smart, funny, beautiful, and overall wonderful as, as her. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm I'm a my, oh, you got me kidding me. Dude, I got dude, I have three more paragraphs of this shit. Oh god. Oh, god. Where's my name? Where's oh, my text? All right, all right. Everyone everyone, just can I at least say this before we continue? 
Sweet Mary Mother of yeah. God. Yes. Fucking bother me by name. <laughs> and I don't do silent players a lot. Okay, all my friends and the people who know me well say that my love is a thing of beauty and quite and quite admirable. But from the outside <laughs> perspective of someone who doesn't know me, you're probably going, wow, that's pretty damn crazy. No shit! Uh, no shit, what, douchebag! Why? And wondering why I don't get a real girlfriend. The truth is, I've had, I've had plenty of real relationships and sexual partners in the 27 years I've been around. Oh, oh God, he's nearly 30. Oh, God. Oh, he's God, over he's already. Right. He, he's me at Tony's age. Fuck it's, you. That's even worse. <laughs> few, hey, I'm not even 30 yet. Shut up. <laughs> A few short relationships, one that lasted seven years and a total of six different sexual partners. So my love for Twilight isn't out of a lack of real world intimacy or relationships. I just yeah, it's all fell, down to mommy issues. I just fell in love with her and my, and my heart di didn't give me much of a choice in the matter. But you know what? I'm totally happy with my love and my relationship. It may seem weird, but it fills me with joy every single day of my life, and I've never been happier. So what if it's weird? It makes me happy, and it doesn't hurt anyone. Then where's the problem? I don't think I don't think there is one. And anyone who, know, who knows me well enough to tell you the same. Now, now you're probably wondering why I'm telling you all this, and how it, and how it concerns you. To you, I'm sure Twilight Sparkle is just a cartoon character. You think he's really hot? No. Fucking ponies are not hot! Anyway, so I imagine you wouldn't think anything of having your friends draw sexually explicit art of her as birthday gifts for you. And hey, I think she's really attractive too, so I can't wait your comments. Alright, that's just not how things go. I think Enigma's going purple. <laughs> No, 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 let's, let's, no, no, okay. let's get it right, let's get it right. Enigma, I think, just went plaid. <laughs> okay, I all I have I have I often I often I often go Oh hey Kelly video. I often, Oh hey I often go on I That often, made me feel better. I often go on E six two one dot dot net and rule thirty four oh, God Real to, uh, to see uh, what to see what new erotic art people have drawn of her. Yeah, that's a fur but, porn site, by the way. But to, but to me, she's more than a cartoon last, character. And every time I go on these sites and see a dozen or so pieces of people, of art pe people have drawn de depicting my girl in various sexual situations with the same person over and over, and that person happens to be you. Don't get me wrong here, though. It, this isn't this isn't a jealousy thing. Oh, thank God, it's not a jealousy thing. I'm no, very thing. <laughs> I'm very secure in my relationship. I know without a question that Twilight is just as I'm almost done. That Twilight is oh. just as faithful to me as I am to her. She's actually sitting on my couch next to me while I, while I type this. She's very real to me, and I know she's not sneaking out in the middle of the night to go have kinky sex with some. <laughs> <laughs> what? And I, and I do. Nick, Steve, and I, 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 I do. I suck at this. <laughs> And I do respect your talent as an artist and an artist's creative freedom to draw whatever they want. That's cool. What bothers me is that in all these birthday images, you've been getting Twilight is always depicted as if she was her sexual plaything, drawn wearing a collar with your name on it or with a or with a speech bubble saying something that would somehow suggest she was your property. I know quite well that Twilight Sparkle is not your plaything nor your property. She is my fiance, so so that bugs me a bit. What I find really loathsome though is your is your is your penchant for rating my partner in both your in both your art and the fan art you've been receiving. Okay, wait. Okay, so I'll just stop here. So basically, that that <laughs> yeah, I. I can't even finish. So, basically, yeah. Okay, I want to see this wedding, and when the priest says, "Does anyone here have any reason why these two should not be wed?" 
And then Lauren Faust and Hasbro's legal team come in saying, okay, this stops right now. <laughs> okay, and, and if anybody wants to read said letter, the link for it is in the uh, Ustream chat. Oh, make no, sure you got the link, because we all want to le- We all want to read that. <laughs> I don't know about you, I, I want to read that. You want to feel better about yourself, read that. <laughs> if you don't want to sleep uh, at night, read it. It got sent to me. Uh, but the sad, the sad part is, this is not an uncommon thing. No, it's not. There it's... is a there, there is a condition. Uh, what what is it called? What is it called? Um, damn it! I know what it's called. Not case syndrome. No, it, it's, it's, syndrome. it's an actual medical con- condition where people are it's sexually some fixation. Uh, okay, hold on. Cool. Object, objectum se- sexual, sexuality. Yep. Okay, and I have more examples of this. Uh, t- Tony, can I at least say something? Of course. This is a fe- this is a fetish that even I can't get into. Yeah, and I, I have more. I, 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 have... I can sit. I've been to do a lot of kinky things. I've never had a. I never had a delusional fantasy about a person or a cartoon character in that level. Well, at least since okay, I was twelve. I have, here we go. I have an image to make the Bronies feel better. After that, I have a. I now will present to you a list of people, mostly Amer, mostly Americans, unfortunately. America. 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 Who have married? Who have married? Fuck in, yeah. Who have married inanimate objects? Oh, good. I know a couple. I know, oh, I know, dear I know, God. I know, I know that there's ones that traffic con. I know there's the one that married a traffic Hasn't someone in Japan married a 3DS? Didn't someone in Japan marry a 3DS? Someone did marry a 3DS. That one is actually on here, and it wasn't the 3DS. It was a character in the game, but he used the 3DS as Yeah, the, yeah, okay. the Love Plus, but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So okay, so we kick we kick this off with the woman who married a roller coaster. What? what? Oh no! Did jer- what? did jerk a sex change? <laughs> Amy Wolf a- Amy Wolf Weber is a church organist who comes from Pennsylvania, and she is married to a roller coaster. the The husband in question is a, is an eighty foot gondola ride called One Thousand and One Knots. The thirty five year old woman says she first fell for the ride at the tender age of thirteen. "Quote: I was. Oh in- no! Did, was there a bump and it broke her virginity? <laughs> Quote: I was instantly attracted to him sexually and mentally. Him. I oh, wasn't him. freaked out as it just felt natural." But I didn't tell anyone about it because I knew it wasn't normal to have feelings for for a fairground ride. Amy ha- Amy has ridden the ride over three thousand times b- before they were married. Oh, you little whore! But I guess she got, has she been has she been riding around with other fucking bloody? But I saw, oh, like, like, oh I saw you me. riding that sky coaster. I don't give me that look. I saw you with the ninja at, at Six Flags. You slut. How do you know? I got the photograph. <laughs> I paid Is twenty dollars. <laughs> Guys, 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 okay, 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 hold on. Guys, uh, Elsie, guys, Elsie, guys Elsie, Elsie please let me finish this last part. Amy claims they have a fulfilling physical and spiritual relationship. She doesn't get jealous when other when other people ride her husband. <laughs> and, and, and Amy, and, oh, and Weber is the name of... Of the rides manufacturer, Amy changed it after she was married. Um, I'm done. I'm done. Where's my fucking gun? I give up. My only okay. question is, who the fuck officiated that? You would- Enigma, do you want to borrow mine? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 Tony, Tony, one thing I gotta say. Tony, one thing I do have to say. At least... She wasn't trying to marry the world. Enigma, of, this will work the, better. The land of imagination. <laughs> right. 
At least she wasn't trying yeah. to. At least she wasn't trying to fucking marry Figment. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, I like and now Jack, then. I wonder, Damn I wonder, what, I wonder what kind of ride some joke with a camera would marry. Space I Mountain. Don't, I, I, I don't want to think about Tony uh, Goldmark marrying anything. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, <laughs> Nick. Was Matt, you do know he was married, right? Oh, oh, so was I. Welcome and, to the club. <laughs> and he divorced. Yeah. Pretty badly, actually. Uh, Nick, I will say this much. And he actually, actually, this. they got divorced right after her, his mother died. Oh, yeah. that's, that's unfortunate. That's bad. But, okay. Nick, I will, say, I will say this. Nick, I will say this. Um, I have a strange feeling that if anybody was going to ride Space Mountain or marry Space Mountain, it would be Spaz. Yep. <laughs> All right. Anybody who was yeah, in Florida knows that answer. What else? Bad else okay. Bad. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, man... <laughs> Man marries steam engine train. Uh, Joe 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 Chim A has a thing for the inner workings of, te of technical objects, which is great since he works as a repairman, but not so great for his spouse, a steam locomotive. A love affair could very well begin with a broken radiator. That's what she said. Job. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Repair? That's not. Oh my. Um, Repair yeah, jobs have yeah, often Tony, led. Tony, yeah. I have a feel. I have a feeling this story is going to bring a whole new meaning to the term "chitty chitty bang bang." Oh God! Oh, oh, really? Yeah. Uh, really? Bad. Bad. Su LC. Susie, slap LC for that terrible joke. I'll get the Quick, get the zapper. Yeah, zap. Yeah. Okay. Repair. That's repair. Me. Oh, repair jobs have often. Thank you, man. Can I have another? <laughs> Repair jobs have often led to, to infidelity in the past. He stresses that people like him, the, the people on the on the list, aren't just fetishists. For some for some people, their car be becomes their fetish, which they use to put themselves in the limelight. For object objectum se sexual, on the other hand, the car itself and nothing else. That's what it says. Is the is the desired sexual partner, and all sexual fantasies and, and emotions are focused on it. Needless to say, this guy loves to fix things. He realized he had a thing for things when he was twelve. He's currently forty-five. He loves his train like he would a person. According to him, quote, "You can reveal yourself to to an object partner in an." intimate in an intimate way in a way that you would never reveal yourself to another person even experience se sexuality together oh god yeah that's called talking to yourself <laughs> pretty much yeah, yeah. like like yeah, like the, like there's a lot of people who do that they talk to this imaginary friend who's called what's his name again oh that's right jesus <laughs> all right, all right. We're not yeah, let, let, let's not go there. We did that on a previous live stream, and it didn't end well. Yeah, let's, no. keep, really the, didn't. let's keep the relationship. I'm an S -O -Y -O -Y -O. Hey, that's LC's thing. Don't you yeah, that's my that. thing. That is my <laughs> thing. And just remember, <laughs> just remember, there is only one imaginary character we worship here on Center Radio, and that, of course, is the Hypno Snarf. Damn straight. And Nick... Just Screw to, you, fool me, Lord and Master. Nick, yeah. just, just And to maybe clarify, the Hoggin. Occasionally the Hoggin. <laughs> just, oh, cool. just to clarify, Nick, LC, she asshole, you're just fucking annoying. Anyway. <laughs> Every time you say Nick, I think you're talking to me. God damn it. <laughs> okay, we, we, need, we need to get some ground rules layered here. Okay, from now on, Nicola will be called Nicola, and Nick will just be called Enigma. All right, fine, fine, Either that fine. or that fucking Aussie dick. Either or. Okay. okay. Oh, you know I got Aussie dick. Oh, yeah. Anyway. Okay. For the next one, Kelly, I will let you pick which one I uh, talk about next. Uh, woman marries the Berlin Wall. A man marries a video game character. Or a woman marries the Eiffel Tower. That's the one I knew about. Video game character all the way. Okay, excellent. Yeah, we have to. 
Okay. A man called Sal 9000 married uh -huh. Mimi. Over 9000, everyone. Over 9000! Anyway. Yes. It's not over 9,000, it's 9,000 <laughs> flat. It's, close it's, flat. It's, it's totally close enough. Go ahead. Married, married, married Nini Aniga, Aniga, Anagasaki. Nini lives inside of a Nintendo DS video game called Love Plus. Oh. The wedding, oh, yeah. the wedding was, was quite an event done before a live audience. Oh, that's good. And brought and broadcast to a virtual one. The Great. bride, the bride who made it, who made it, who made a speech, and groom were married by a real human priest. While normal people worry about growing up, Sal Nine Thousand has to worry about the, the fact that a Nintendo DS is completely outdated at this point, and GameStop will not take returns on used equipment. Oh my god. The and fact particularly that ones that have had damage to the headphone ports. And there is a video of the wedding. Oh, fuck me. Oh yeah, yeah. I've seen this on Game Exchange. <laughs> there is a video of the wedding. Oh god. Well... Um, <laughs> I, I don't know if I want to ask you for the link to that, or if I just want to ignore that, the fact that I'll tell this you what, happened. I'll, te I'll tell you what, I will put it in the Ustream chat. If you, you do that. If you're feeling great. And I will secretly, great. <laughs> and I will secretly not, oh, it comes up as censored. That's not fair. Oh, okay, well. It. I'll just put it. Send it. Just send it to me. You got me. Good thing, the, good thing the honeymoon wasn't recorded. Oh, <laughs> okay. Now, Susie. Hi. Now, Su Susie. Now you get to. Now you get to pick one. Yay. Okay. You have a choice of uh, five. Bollywood. Bo Bollywood actress marries a tree. <laughs> A man marries a Barbie doll. Oh, fuck me. Wait, wait, wait. A man marries a picture of himself. No, oh, three. Number three, baby. Man marries an iBook. Or man marries a sex doll. Oh, oh I'm seeing three. Oh, my. Okay, the third, the third one. Let me no, 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 guys, 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 this is Susie's pick. No, I just want to know one thing. Yeah. With the third pick, the guy that married himself. Is his name Zab Brannigan? <laughs> uh, Su Susie, what, uh, pick, pick your poison, hon. I don't know why, but I want to hear number two, even though I hate Barbie dolls for the passion. Okay, I'll tell you I what. I know, the bitch has everything. I'll tell you what, we'll do, we'll, we, will, we will do number two and three. So, okay. we'll do that. Okay. A Taiwan okay, man marries Barbie doll. A Taiwanese man named Chang Hisun Hassum, 46, said he needed to marry a doll in order to appease the restless spirit of his dead wife. Not even the adult kind of doll most self-respecting weirdos like marrying, but a Barbie doll of uh, but but a Barbie but a Barbie doll, a 11-inch plastic doll. Apparently, uh, apparently the ceremony was quite elaborate. Barbie. Wait, it, it was just it was just like the normal doll. Yeah, like... eleven inch doll. Yeah. Oh. Apparently, the ceremony was quite elaborate. Barbie's so spoiled with her dream house and yacht that he had to show her a better way to live by by having the, the wedding take place at his local Buddhist temple. Oh. oh. My oh, God. that is someone who has possibly some mental issues. Wow. I think all of these people have mental issues. Well, they do, but <laughs> well, like, then again, the Buddhists, though, they're, they're usually this so was in Malaysia. Yeah. Uh, the man this believes... This is the same culture who believes that if you're born under certain conditions, you'll be plagued with demons unless you marry a dog. Lovely. So this is the same culture that marries newborns to dogs to try and save their souls from eternal damnation and torment from demons? I, I did not know that. And <laughs> yeah. I think you for telling me that because otherwise I would look like an asshole. So thank you. 
<laughs> this is why I'm on the show. Because no one knows everything. Okay, okay. LC, uh, t- t-shirt idea. Nicola knows everything. Get it done. Oh, definitely. <laughs> oh, definitely. Okay. Just stay here with the man. The, the man believes the doll houses the spirit of his wife, who killed herself twenty years ago because uh, family oh. is obsessed over their marriage. Um. Yeah. That no, is. Op- 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 oppose their. Though. Oppose their marriage. Sorry. This was from uh-huh. Japan, correct? No, Taiwan. Taiwan. Close, close enough. I mean, come on. This is the same. This is the same society no, no, that basically no. has a work has a statue they of a dog. Like, no, 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 no. It's it. But really, it's it's not. It's not like Japan, Ashley, at all. They could not um, be different. It, it, it's clo- it's place. close enough. Suicide. The the spirit won't go to rest until they come. They actually get what they want. They don't. Yeah, it's, Japan it's, doesn't. She wanted to be with her husband. Look, so Japan doesn't do this like at all. So. It's kind uh, of like... <clears throat> okay. Either, really way, either either way, I am just scared to see what the fuck Death Honey Moon looked like. Yeah. What else you got? <laughs> this... Okay. According to the news story, the ceremony appeared to be like a wedding unlike like oh. any other, with the bride's obnoxious family waiting outside the temple for the groom's arrival. <laughs> the bride... Okay. Uh, yeah. Kelly, you were going to say something? No, I'm waiting for you to say Oh, oh, oh sorry. I thought, uh, okay. After the wedding, Channing and his new bride returned to their home together with an urn which contained his wife's ashes. Okay. The urn will be placed at their, at their home, and from now on, the wife will be re- regarded as a member of the family. The groom's family ha- has, has asked the wife's for forgiveness by, by giving the, their blessing to the marriage, thus placating her spirit. Um, yeah, because them spirits get nasty. Chang, Chang said, quote, I have waited for this I have waited for this day for 20 years. Even after all this time, I, am, I, fell, in, I, I fell in love with her, with her now. I fell in love with her. Now I will marry her spirit and take her home. Oh, fuck you. Oh, God, no. Fuck you. I'm sorry. You might as well. That's yeah. some pretty bad fucked up Danny Phantom fan fiction right yeah, there. Yeah, that's ridiculous. I'm sorry. There is a point, and I, I, I was going, before I did entomology, I was going to be entomol- or, uh, anthropologist. I'm glad I didn't do that. Oh, oh, it, yeah. that was, what the? Yeah, maybe that will work. I don't even know. Yo, I, you made me speechless. I don't even know what to say. But before you know, you get there's out, something that worries me: is the fact there. that I'm not reacting to these I'm, stories. I don't. I'm not saying that they're bad, but the thing is, is yeah. that because it's a culture. But the thing is, is that it's so ridiculous that it's hard to believe that they don't realize that they're. They have to know that they're like doing wrong. They have to know that. Oh, well, we're gonna just gonna see this spirit. There's no way that you can actually. I'm sorry. I maybe I am I incorrect. Maybe I'm incorrect. From their culture, they would think us worshiping a 2,000 uh, year old carpenter who died on the cross would be ridiculous. Well, it's all about cultural perspective. That's, that's Christianity and all, but you know what? Like, I do. You, yeah. I mean, just the story alone just is kind of. Bizarre. There is, is I- there is one last thing here. But before you get all sentimental, Chang did not spend 20 years alone. After his wife's oh, death... Oh, good! Huh. It, after his wife's death, he remarried, and this ceremony was carried out with his current wife's blessing! He is what? still married! Ah, that is the worst episode of Cheetahs ever! <laughs> No, seriously, Young what? Man, where where is the woman? And why is your dick covered in ash? <laughs> <laughs> Holy oh. shit, I thought I had a bad time after I divorced. What the hell is wrong with these fucking people? Alright. Well, to be fair, that's... At least I... At least I... I was a at, least, at least after my divorce, I isolated myself and freaking started making internet videos. 
Makes my breakup look like people? playtime. Okay, now we are on to the uh, one that I find the most interesting of the, of the five here. Yes. T- Tony, are we... I, I have to ask, because... Uh-huh. And the only reason... I, I had to ask only because these are very exhausting. How are we... Where are we? Are we almost done, or like... Uh, pretty much, We're on yeah. the internet, dear. Oh, I know. That's just not what I mean. That's not what I mean. And I'm happy to be here, and this is fun. But I have to say, like, all this stuff, like, my mind is, like, processing. It's, like, yeah. it's becoming, like, a gear on its own self. Yeah, it's kind of, like, it's, like, oh. Yeah. So well, what else met- you got for me, baby? Okay. Well, well, now we well met- they're all so easily well met- broken. What the hell? <laughs> Seriously. Well, if it, well, if it helps, man, just my brain's over in the corner. <laughs> Mine went bye bye. Well, well Manus, Manus, let me at least say this: as uh, as your second appearance ever here on Cine Radio, uh, welcome to the party. This is what we talk about a lot of times. Yeah, I complained about the inconvenience of bombings in my local area, but yeah, you don't have to get you don't have to get drunk for these shows, but it does help. Trust me. Yeah, I I have showed. Welcome to my philosophy. I drink a bottle. I drink a bottle of wine. I don't think that you guys could notice that. <laughs> I, I, I uh, noticed there was a bottle of something. I didn't know why. Uh, you're, you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Man, it's, don't it's worry. Fine. You're the okay. only alcohol fueled show on the well on the reviewer as far as I know. Yeah. Well, it's well besides my show of course. Yeah. Mm. Oh, no, I'm kidding. No, well, man, was, man, it's, that's why you and me have to get together one time and do a crossover because. Yes. The artist, oh no! Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You two doing a crossover? No site would ever host that. You don't know that. My liver <laughs> would never be the same I if would, me and her ever got together. It would, be, it would be censored in at least three countries. Hey, yes. hey, hey, guys! I will call it right now. You two do a crossover. I will put it on my fucking site. I'll say that right now. There you go. Okay. Oh, by the way, Kelly, see, yes. I'm wearing a shirt. Oh, yeah. Never wear that in New York. <laughs> it will be a fucking target. Oh, no, oh no, fuck no. yeah. No, actually, Tony's well, correct. In, Tony in is correct. City, you ne- uh, never wear uh, any New York sh- When you're in New York, never wear any New York shirt that's not Yankees or Mets. I am showing guess my what? If you wore that in New York City, it's pretty much saying, come mug me. I am, I am wearing this to show my support for Kelly. So. Yeah. <laughs> and I'll say right now, that's not... A hundred percent true. It's kind of a, but go ahead. All right, now we have mar- a man marries a picture of himself. Oh, uh, the narcissist. <laughs> and I must emphasize this. This is a life size picture, like a like, 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 like a it, cutout. A life size cardboard cutout. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, t- Tony. Tony. Can let me reframe. So I got the full picture on this one. A okay. man married. A picture of himself. Yes. Please tell me it's because he wants to freaking never age. No, the the reason he he actually gives a reason why he did this. Oh, so because he could. Well, well, there's well, there's that, but okay. Thirty nine year old Chinaman Lu Lu Yi married a life size cut out photo of himself wearing a red bridal gown. I didn't even know they came in bright. I didn't even know they came in red. He said he was dissatisfied with reality. Oh. So he married himself. Well, I guess when you guess that's a valid you have, reason? Well, if you, that's, that's an admission of uh, I'm not. Uh, that, that's a problem. Like, but, okay, see, I just see, have to say least, one see, thing about at, this entire entire situation. This is all legal, yet marrying someone of the same gender is a is big not, issue. Is yeah. not. Please, yeah. I want to go to the National Organization of Marriage and explain to us: you let people marry a 3DS, a car, a, a roller coaster, a picture of themselves, their late w- wife's ashes. Well, okay, to be fair... And a video game character and everything else, and that's two guys or two girls marrying? To be, to be fair, uh, some of, most of these take place out of the country, 
and the uh, these these marriages legally are not rec- are not recognized. Uh, Nick, so Nick, to bring they up- are merely they are merely um, they are merely giving into their de- delusions. So. Uh, Nick, Nick, so so I can bring some of the light into the laws. Uh, most of these aren't state in the United States for gay marriages, and if they are, they're considered state marriages, not federal marriages, which means the federal law does not actually consent it. Yeah. All right. Susan, so- I bang my hand to a wall again. <laughs> okay. The wedding took place in the square of Guan Guanzhou Village before before friends. And weirded out local villagers. <laughs> <laughs> local villagers. Really? Yeah. <laughs> all oh of god, the, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good. All of the all of the ancient Chinese wedding traditions were honored, including the the bride kowtowing to heaven and earth, to ancestors and to and to elderly age ninety and over. Bride and groom made the tr- traditional rounds of toasting guests. During the ba- the banquet, re- one one guest said, "Quote, it's it's a really grand wedding, except that the that the bride is a photo." <laughs> uh, okay, self described. Yeah, self. De- yeah, that's well. What, that that was what one of the um one of the guests said. Wow. Well, then, at least someone has their brain semi intact. I suppose. In- Self-described as a quote angry Chinese youth at best, Lu, Lu Yi d- denies he is gay, but does admit to being a little narcissistic. No shit. I said only wow. a little. Okay, I, okay, cra- crazy thought. Okay, um, if you cloned yourself, but gave your clone a sex change, let me consider incest or masturbation. It's still ma- it's still masturbation. Free it's creepy, but still it's masturbation. It's it depends on which moral scale you accept a clone on. It's not gay, it's masturbation. Thank you, Hal. <laughs> well It can't be gay because your clones now the other gender. <laughs> right, what well, it's not gay, it's you on you. <laughs> it's uh, you too. Yeah, uh, uh fuck you too. Anyway. Princess? Uh, <laughs> Uh, he said, marrying myself is a process of de- deconstructing and, re- and reconstructing myself. I make, I make use of the wedding to, re- to reconsider opposite sex marriage. My, my behavior seems ridiculous, but I am traditional and conservative and hard, so the wedding ceremony is traditional. Yeah, it's traditional, right? Okay. Especially in Asia. Now we're going to the uh, now we're going to the last four, our final four. Now, Nicola. Oh dear. You it, yo, I gotta, I gotta, I had to ask, and yeah. I don't want to miss it. I can I use the restroom like super quick? You can go ahead and do your thing. Yeah, I'll be back in like uh, two seconds. Uh, feel free. I just go go to the out. bathroom. Go to the liquor cabinet if you want. Ha- go <laughs> right. fucking nuts. Uh, do, do what you gotta do, hon. I'll be back. Do- all right. Run, I'm run, sorry, run, I don't run. have that cool effect that I use for myself when I take a piss. Good accent guy told me that I can. I'll be back. Oh. <laughs> run before it's too late. <laughs> okay. okay, continue, Tony. <laughs> All right, Nicola, you have your choice be- between woman marries a radio, <laughs> woman marries pet rock, Oh, okay. These are just three. Sorry, and man marries a pillow. Was the marriage Is it in one pi- of those love pillows? A was pet? the marriage was the marriage a pillow performed in a prison? No, it was in a church. Oh fuck me! A pet? No. Rock. That one seems to get. Really? That guy yeah. really liked. Is it weird cream, that this he? is the only one that has kind of tweaked in my head as being strange? Yeah, Nicola, I think that guy really liked chafing. Uh... Well, it was a woman who married a pet rock. Then again, it depends on the size of the rock. It could all be it, used. All it, all it is it a smooth is... rock? Nicola, Ted? Nicola, don't, Nicola, don't. All in fairness. 
Any man who has ever been married eventually marries a rock. <laughs> right? Oh. Yeah. Zap. 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 Yeah, all right, there, <laughs> thank, thank you, thank you, my beautiful, sexy uh, fiance, the black pussy chick. Uh, by the way, can I have two more of those because my balls feel good right now? Anyway. We have to up the voltage on this, Susie. You don't get them for that. Okay, okay. Well, well, the the okay. I'll go ahead and tell you about the the, the rock the rock one be, be because it's really really fucking short. And nineteen. 19- oh, thank God. In 1976, Secretary Janine Swift married a 50-pound piece of of granite. Guess it really rocked her world. Oh, that's actually what what says. That's actually what it said. I did not. I did not make up that crappy joke. It actually said that in the thing. So (laughs) no, no. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. So I married a rock. It rocked my world. Oh. Okay, so Nicola, I let you choose between British woman who marries a radio and Korean man who marries a pillow. Hold on, I got another one. My my wife replaced herself with a rock. She just lay there in bed. I couldn't tell the difference. Yeah, again, uh-huh. anybody anybody who's been married for more than three to five yeah. years knows that feeling. Like, hey baby, you wanna play? Hey baby, you wanna play? You want you wanna play house? You'll be the screen door, and I'll and I'll slam you all night long. Oh, Susie, let's just add this to the tally of what you need to hit LC for when you see him again. <laughs> What's that tally up to you know, A couple of thousand? <laughs> no. Okay. All right. I, I, I hey, sorry. I'm 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 back. It's okay. Hello. Hey. It's back. Okay. We're, we're just we're we're just discussing the. Are we ending? We are. We uh, are no, we're just we we're we're, we're just discussing the difference between um marrying a rock or being married for five years and feeling like it's a rock. <laughs> yeah, and uh, I'm gonna hit you with a wheelbarrow when I see you next, honey. <laughs> okay, so three okay, of them. Okay, so, so what what exactly is the difference? <sighs> if, they're, Thank if, you. if they're both. No, if they're both rocks, then what's the difference? Like, wait a minute. If I say something, is it going to go all over the place and cause a problem? No, no, you're right. Nah, nah, no, no, no. This, this, is, this, is, a, this is an open entertainment. Let's move on yeah. from this one because Please. we made so many jokes in regards to this. We're just retreading old ground again. Okay. We've traveled no, this joke so much, the rock is now gravel. Okay, 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 Nicola, uh, you, have two, you have two to pick from. Woman, Let's go with the radio because I'm curious about that. Okay, woman marries her radio. A British woman who goes by the name of Emma because she wishes to remain anonymous. Anonymous. No, really, I no, the name would be no, J-Lo. Says she fell in lo- Shut up. Says that she fell in love with a, with a, with a hi-fi system she <gasps> called... She calls Jake. Oh, I have a teddy Jake, bear called Jake. Jake, she I, says, is a quote solid, is solid, reliable, and beautiful. She re- she re- she repairs him when he goes wrong, and makes love to him on average twice a day. Stop! Just stop. All right, this yeah. is a high price system we're talking about. If this is the one that was uh, marketed over here, those things are huge. They have uh, a record player on the top. They have two cassette tape players, and they have speakers this size. And this whole setup is fucking huge. It's bigger than my monitors. And it's also weighs a goddamn ton. That is a high five system here. Okay, I, th- I I think I can understand this one. I think I can understand this one. Um, well, how big are the covered. subwoofers? How big are the subwoofers on that uh, stereo system? This is four subwoofers. Okay, I understand completely how this actually this marriage worked. She sticks Barry White on him. That, damn straight. Let's get it on. As it vibrates, it's gonna Let's get it on. <laughs> Let's get on. So, so, yeah. So to so to sum up, 
gay people cannot get married, but you can marry a radio, a fuck pillow, a cartoon character, uh, a pet, a pet rock, the Berlin Wall, a roller coaster, and a train. Well, well, Sean Cooper wouldn't mind marrying a train. <laughs> I have no idea what that means. <laughs> I guess no one here watches Big Bang Theory. I do actually watch Big Bang Theory. I'm yeah. sorry, Big Bang Theory is just is just. Insulting. And here it comes. And here it comes. It's just insulting to nerd culture, Kelly. I love you. Okay, I'm going to ask this right now. Contrast. I'm going. Then I'm again, gonna ask you right I now, feel Tony. kind of sad when I laugh at the science jokes and then I then have to pause the episode and explain them to my parents. <laughs> okay, okay, Tony, name me one sitcom with realistic characters. Um, how I met your oh. how I, how I met your mother. Friend. Are you kidding me? Are yeah. you kidding me? No, you would not meet no... someone like Ted OSB in real life. I there am, is no I, such thing. There is no dude, such thing in entertainment think, that is not online dude, where you actually dude, meet I real fucking people. was Ted Mosby. What are you talking about? <laughs> I know a number of people who uh, act like Sheldon Sheldon due to um I know autism, Asperger. I, I know. Well, I know too. I know plenty of people that that act that fucking act like Barney from how, from How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> yeah, but nobody could be as cool as Barney. Well, nobody. there's also a lot of people out there. Who also, that's Neil that... Patrick Harris. You cannot win oh. against Neil Patrick Harris. But like I'm saying though, like, and I'm not. You know, I like the show. I'm not defending myself or liking it. I I like it, and that's it. But, it's a good show. Uh, I like it. Yeah, I mean, it's totally I see unrealistic, why... but I like it. Exactly, <laughs> I I see why people don't like it. I also see why people are digging way too much into it and saying that it's like severely offensive. But I will say that the most the character of Leonard is like the most realistic character there is because he is he's the relatable. I one. felt that I felt that a million times, and maybe that doesn't sound right, but when I was in high school and, and all that stuff, like that's how I felt. And I will I don't say, think... uh, I'm sorry, Kelly. I mean, I, I need to cut you off. Yeah, 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 yeah. You were once led, but now you're a penny. <laughs> <laughs> I will, in terms of in terms of attractiveness, I will say that. <laughs> I, no, I, I was okay. Wait, 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 hold up, because you know what? I have a little bit of like vanity that I need to just kind of push over. No, I was never. Please, I mean, I, have you ever seen the guy who plays Leonard on one of the award ceremonies? Sorry, he's fucking hot. I, I he apologize. is. He's fucking ripped. Yeah. You never take your shirt off of the shoe because he's fucking ripped. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, okay, okay. I will say this. I am not saying that, you know, I am fully offended by the, the show because I've it's seen dumb. I've seen it's... I've seen bits and I've seen bits and pieces of it. I'm not a fan, but it's when so I when I fun. yeah, but when I hear about like the big, the big uh, story is that ooh, a girl's coming into a comic book store. It's just like fucking really. I'll give you that. I but mean, you know what? Though? But you know what though? I will be honest with you because there are, there are about in, in my town. There are about like in the suburb area. There's like five comic book stores. I I'm absolutely 100% honest with you. Mm -hmm. When I walk in there, the place goes fucking like cockroach silent. <sighs> And that's how it is. And all I'm looking for, all I'm looking for is, like, Batman comics, like, something with Harley Quinn. I like the X-Men yeah. story with Hope in it. I'm looking for that stuff. And I need help because the shit's all over the place. And I ask help, and either they laugh at you, kind of, like, under their breath, like, don't know what they're talking about. Or they just stand there. And yeah, someone's like, wait a minute. <laughs> And excuse me, yeah, maybe the show is stereotypical of that, but you know what? Oh, you're going to get so offended about that, but you know, not you, Tony. I'm talking, uh, yeah. like, in general. I'm talking about everyone who gets offended about, you know what? How about, A, 
if that ever happens, how about you offer to help that girl or guy or wh- whoever it is? How about you offer to help them find what they're looking for? Because if they did, I wouldn't have to ask the asshole behind the counter. Second of all, if you're owning this store, why don't you ask exactly where I'm, like, what timeline and what generation and what goddamn team or whatever I'm looking for and help me. And if you don't have it, just tell me you don't have it. Yeah. Ask me. Are you looking for this specific, you know, number? What, and if you don't think that I know what I'm talking about, ask me. Yeah. Go by, okay, well, go by, even if someone were to go by costume. Okay, Harley Quinn. Okay, well, are you looking for comics with her, with her, her, you know, uh, Batman animated series? That's the one with the red and black. Are you looking for the one where she's a nurse? Because that's a video game. Are you looking for the one where she's kind of, you know, she looks real young and she's got the... Because that's another video game, but you kind of get it in the comics. Are you looking for something with red and blue? Because that's the comics, but we're getting rid of that. And it's kind of going into a video game. You see what I'm saying? Like, this is fixable. And I don't see why it's... I I see why people can get offended, but I think that's got a little bit of vanity to do with it. I think that's a little bit of... Way right, so, so, Kel- so, Kel- so Kelly, Kelly in, all, in all the words you're just you back in on that tangent there. <laughs> so, so Kelly, so Kel- so Kelly, basically, in other words, you're just asking for the person running the comic book store, working the comic book store, and pretty much everyone who's getting a paycheck being in that comic book store to do customer <laughs> fucking service. Well, yeah, and you know what? I wouldn't mind either if someone was in the comic book store look like and knew what i was looking for and like gave me some help i'm not gonna fucking bite them in the neck and i'm not gonna fucking like claw oh. them just because well, i'm a girl Kelly, it Kelly, doesn't Kelly, fucking... in all fairness it all some fairness, guys might like that yeah Kelly, Kelly, Kelly. <laughs> in all fairness in all fairness you are what most people what everybody be, else but be me nice because yourself. i just love my girlfriend a be very nice beautiful yourself. attractive woman and you intimidate them just plain and simple I I think, just, I think, I think that's the thing. Every time I just go and, in, I just want some yeah. Harley Quinn comics. That's all. I think yeah. that's the thing. Every time yeah. an attractive girl goes into a comic book store, everybody thinks that you know, like, okay, comic book people have seen pretty girls, but before it's not like we're in there drooling and like, wait a minute, you're one of them ladies. <laughs> you know? <laughs> just, no, and I don't. I don't expect that. Thing. I don't expect that to be that way. I just expect to walk into a store and be treated normally and just buy what I want to, get some help if I need to, and leave. But you know what, Kelly? At the end of the day, you know... Maybe I'm a naive. Prob- I don't know. No, you're not naive. You, pro- you, pro- you probably know more about what's going on in there than, 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 than they do. And you just got to go in there and fucking school them. That's all there yeah, is. Yeah, I've been in this situation before in a, a GameStop. I came on and I was looking for, I think it was one of the Call of Duty games. It was back when they were Game, decent. GameStop, that shit's... And the <laughs> fellas, I was looking around, it was a really badly organized store. And a fella came over and says, uh, here I know what you're looking for. And I was like, really? Okay, mom with me. And he brings me over to this most insulting little stand I've ever seen. And it was Games for Girls with a Z. Oh. Fuck that guy. It was was Barbie Adventure. It was Nintendogs and all that air. And I looked at him and went, seriously? He went, yeah, this is all you'll need. And I went, no. No, yeah, actually, I I had gay games. (laughs) Yeah, it was like, Really? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me define You're that joke. So me to do get, this? Uh, let me define. Let me find that joke so I don't get crucified. I am meaning from the Blazing Saddle joke where they says, "You know, gay people sound like steam." <laughs> hey, where do I? Hey, where do white women at? Sorry. <laughs> no, that's how I walk into a club. You realize the gays are fabulous. fabulous. Oh, I love the love gays. Up. We all know I love the gays. And, they, yeah. uh, and the lady, and LC, Susie, they Susie, Susie knows that. Uh, Susie knows that. Uh, you know, I love the games too much. <laughs> we know 
we we've seen we, but on my last seen, seen on my the Tony, video on my, the on my final on my final homeware rotting joke of the night let's just say this let's round this up let's end this up tony final thoughts of the night uh i want to give a happy birthday to mr patrick alexander so happy birthday to, to, to him rah 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 and all that good stuff uh, Kelly, it was lovely as always to have you here. Got nothing but love for you, darling. So yeah, we all love you. <laughs> Everybody oh, loves you. Don't her. remember who I am. <laughs> all right, Nick. I remember Nick. you. Don't. <laughs> Nick, I need my screen right now. Final words of the night. My need. Yeah, marriage. Get sorted out. Seriously. Prioritize. Amen. And, and of course, my New York little... review is on Screw Attack right now, and I'm working on the next one, which is Tomb Raider. Woohoo! Yay. Nice. Awesome. And, good. and uh, right. screaming right. Kelly Mantis herself. What is your final words of the night? Fuck, I don't even know. This this night was great. Um, sexism is bad. I don't know what else. So this, hey, you're you welcome. Kinda... And also, Kelly, you're welcome back here anytime. Yeah, we should have yeah. you again because you have some interesting <laughs> input. Thank <laughs> you. Yeah, I we know. Need to, we I need didn't think Kelly, I was... Kelly, we need to get you on when we have like uh, a smaller group crowd. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I've well, learned the lesson. It... Like, this many people just never ends well with conversation. <laughs> well, <laughs> Nick, is there something down there interesting? <laughs> call me in. You guys need to call me in. You can Definitely. always do it. Definitely. Uh, you will be back again, I guarantee. And, of course, my beautiful, sexy fiancé, the love of my life, that black pussy chick. Susie, you what is your final thoughts on right? I think she's asleep. I'm not. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. No. My, br my, my brain's dead. Um, this is why I flushed Barbie down the toilet when I was eight. Um, Good on you, girl. True story. I got a Barbie for my eighth birthday, and I flushed it down the toilet the second the person left. The, birth, the birthday party, and I'm so fucking glad I am getting married to a person. I shouldn't shout that. Uh, honey, I wouldn't I, exactly I swear say to God, person. Happen, this never happened before. But having a penis has never happened before. <laughs> uh, in all fairness, in all fairness, people, uh, Susie, I wouldn't exactly say a. Person. Did you just quote Robot Chicken? Yes, I did. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Everyone feared the mighty vagina. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. No. Yet again, Bad a joke me. that just went nowhere. I was going to say, uh, that's Susie, not I would a joke not necessarily... I would have expected from Tony Helms. Good point. Uh, I don't have right, a and, 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 and I wasn't done. I wasn't done. I wasn't done. I wasn't done. All right, Susie. Let her finish. Let her finish. And people be surprised. I have a review coming out this week. Yay! Go oh. clap. It on what? Where can we find it? Uh, pretty much everywhere. <laughs> um, there you go. Well, you can, on, you, you, can Arby's, 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 you can find the Black Punch Chick videos. You can find the Black Punch Chick videos. Lost remnants of RBT. You can find the Black Punch Chick videos anywhere. You can find Center Radio almost on RBT, RBTEntertainment.com, TheZeroLevel.com, and the one site that will not pick me up because I scared the shit out of them, AgonyBooth.com. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it, I review Cars too, and yeah. you pretty much get to see me screaming at the top of my lungs. I have never seen uh, any of the car movies. Oh, so that I take this is also your uh, audition for porno. <laughs> no, 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 Nick did you Extreme? too? Did you and LC just say that? Yeah. Nick Enigma Extreme. Yes. If we're, okay, Nick, I'm telling you right now, her addition for porn if, is when she's with me. Okay, Nick. If yeah, we're, I've seen if, those videos, LC. Nick, if we're yes. telling you way, Susie, you're first, going to talk, so you first know I, I do said Nick loves I am the, so, uh, so sorry. Like that's like three. Okay. Okay. I am so sorry. I think I need to get shot. I get <laughs> Yeah, I do too, actually. Okay, okay. <laughs> Nicola, final words of the night. Don't try and punch a cheese grater. It hurts. Stand there. Ow. Understandable. Well, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, you can set the age. 
Thanks for joining us again here on Center Radio. Super St. Louis segment. I got to get back to the music, people. Bye. Very, very loose. Very, very loose. Behave uh, yourself, children. Definitely. Laws. Yay!